Are you working hard or working smart? Here's what working hard looks like. You offer a wide range of services and you're the go-to person for all questions and inquiries. When you offer a prize, you're open for negotiations where you end up going front and back with your clients until the price is agreed. On starting the project, you realize that you're spending longer than expected because of the constant revisions demanded by your clients. At the end, you've spent three more weeks than expected, but you're happy with it because you've delivered your best work for your client. Now, let's see what working smart looks like. Rather than having a wide range of services, you offer only two to three packages or options for your client. To help with questions and inquiries, you have a template explaining in detail the features of each package. Now, rather than doing all the work by yourself, you offer this project to your team of freelancers with all the information detailed in the feature of the package. You pay your team and the project is delivered on time. See, in the working hard scenario, here is the issue. You spend more of your time working on the project and less of your time looking for other business opportunities. With regards to the number of revisions, if this is not made clear at the start of the project, you may have just opened a can of worms. Why? Because this will lead to endless revisions, extending the time of the project even further. Now, although your client is satisfied with your work, but remember, this was not delivered on the time and the date you have promised. With Working Smart, you spend less of your time on the project and more of your time looking for other business opportunities. Your client is aware of the number of revisions, the price and all relevant information at the beginning of the project. So then for you, it's a win-win scenario. So my question for you today is, what task are you doing right now that you need to get rid of? Can it be done quicker or faster by someone else? Could you spend more of your time on duties that you're more qualified or have more experience to do? There is a saying, effort is important, but knowing where to make an effort is more important. So do not spend your valuable time on tasks you do not enjoy doing or are unimportant or irrelevant, or can be simply done quicker and faster by someone else. Put your effort on important things that you're good at. So here are the three things you can do right now. Number one, review your goals and prioritize your tasks, focusing on only the important ones at any one time. Number two, delegate to someone that is more skilled or more experienced than you, that can do the job quicker or faster, or even someone that can take away the tasks that are less important to you. Number three, have clear templates for both your clients and your team. So then, what have you done recently the smarter way?